An Israeli soldier dead, three Palestinians dead, militants, protesters. But, my God, a Palestinian killed an Israeli soldier. That's it. Let's bring out the big bombs and bomb Gaza. This has been going on. It didn't just start. I will link below to a plaintruth.info's video. Israel bombs the crap out of Palestinians again. U.S. silent as we are always. Killed two Palestinian teenagers. Doesn't matter how many Palestinians get killed. It doesn't matter that Gaza gets leveled by Israeli bombs. Nothing matters. What matters is <gasps> an Israeli soldier died. I will link below to a very important documentary, The Occupation of the American Mind. The American Mind has been occupied by news coming out of Israel, the propaganda, the lies. Everything's a lie. No matter what you read, mainstream media, when it is about what the Israeli government is doing, what the Palestinians are doing, you can bet that you are fed a lie. And this documentary really brings that home. I will link to it below. I hope that you circulate it, and I want to thank this is the subscriber who left this in a comment, the link in, in the comment section. I can't stand how nothing ever changes. But in order to have change, it means individuals have to change. So, very few individuals do anything to change. And most have closed minds. Most really do prefer to continue on with the lies because lies allow us to never change. We just accept whatever is fed to us by mainstream media or government officials. The truth is very demanding. It requires time and energy. And I think subconsciously people understand that the truth may change them. Oh my God, if I knew the truth, I might have to do something about that knowledge that I have acquired. How can I just sit back, watch TV if I know the truth? If I know the lies, well, I can just sit back, do nothing, live my comfortable life. That's very sad. The link is below. The link is below. I recommend that... Well, you probably already know. You don't even have to read these articles. You can pretty much put it together, piece it together, based on your knowledge of the lies. It's the same old, same old. The Palestinians are at fault. Israel, never at fault. We get to bomb the shit out of those that we have imprisoned. They can't escape, but we get to bomb their hospitals, their schools. Innocent people, we don't care. Children will drop bombs on them on a beach. We don't care. Because we can lie, and that's it. That's what we do. And Americans... Well, they'll, they'll support us, support us, they'll believe it. Not all. But as long as we continue to get, oh, it's more money now that Trump is in office. What did he increase it to 3.8 billion from 3 billion a year? As if Americans don't need that money and as if the Israelis do. No, we just give them money. To bomb. These are American bombs, by the way, that are killing innocent Palestinians. Manufactured in the USA, 